All right, well, welcome. My name is uh, Tom Korn. I'm the Senior Vice President of Security Products at VMware, and I'm uh, honored to be here with Sean Bass, who's the VP and Chief Technology Officer for End User Computing and a fellow security buff and maven. And uh, Sean and I were really just talking about really the transformation that's happening in security, uh, how things are changing, how the problems are becoming harder, but also new opportunities in security in leveraging the infrastructure and new approaches to it. Welcome. Sean. Thanks, Tom. Thanks for having me. So I think there's a number of things that are happening. Obviously, we're seeing a massive amount of de device proliferation happening in our industry where you know, it used to be one user had one PC and they accessed all the corporate data inside the four walls and things were very simple. I guess the big takeaway for me is just the problem has become so large and so complex and, and the infrastructures that we're working with are so complex that I, 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 we're getting lost. Yeah, right. And uh, we've talked a lot about this, going back to this really early principle of cyber hygiene, this principle of least privilege. Yes. And how that could be applied in new ways today. Um, in order to shrink the problem and refocus security on users and applications and data. So I, I agree with you that getting back to the basics and doing some simple principles like least privilege can, can help dramatically. And the concept of least privilege can be applied all over the place. I think the beauty of it is about focusing on risk and thinking about where the non-value added risks are, right? There are, the stuff that you guys do to enable us to use our personal devices in conjunction with work creates huge productivity, right? right? Um, but it's a risk. There's ways of managing that risk. But at least privilege is an enormous amount of risks we're taking that actually don't add actually any business value. They're just open attack surface. Uh, and allowing us to bring focus and reduce, eliminate a lot of those open things. So in the data center, we have a slightly, I think, easier problem with least privilege in that um, uh, a lot of things are more single purpose and immutable. This incredible um, growth in micro segmentation um, really can be explained by this principle. People starting to say, these are my critical applications in my data center, and there's no reason for these things to be wide open and connected to absolutely everything. If I can draw a logical boundary around them and say, they should have access to each other and to the things they need, but start closing off other doors and also make that a policy primitive. Now I have something to align my controls to. I can say, I'm not just placing network security controls on random network links. I'm aligning those controls to the applications they're really trying to protect. It's a, it's a big step forward for us.